tell us in the comments. Don't forget to hit the like button and share this video with everyone you know. Uh, step one no, is create a concept. A concept is a one statement lang yan. It's a core idea of a song. No, yung, pag tinanong, ano concept ng kanta mo? Kaya lang, may, may kwento mo yun eh sa isang statement. Like, ito, ang concept ko dito ay isang kanta na tungkol sa isang lalaki na bulag siya. Pero kung kung siya ay magmahal eh, parang uh, sampu ang kanyang mata. Ganon. Or, uh, isang kanta na uh, uh, ang concept ko dyan eh, para akong minamartilyo ang aking puso sa, sa aking nararamdaman mga damdamin. So, yun step one, concept. Ang step two, yung concept mo, i-convert mo sa isang title. So, limawa, no? yung concept ko, yung una, bulag. Hindi, gawin ko title siya. Uh, uh, ang pag, uh, pag-ibig na walang nakikita. O, bulag ang pag-ibig. Or, uh, I see you now, I, I don't, ano, uh, I cannot see you. Or, hindi kita mapansin. Or, gano, i-convert mo lang siya sa title. In the process, actually, you come up with several, eh. With several na, ano yun, eh, na options, eh. Pero lagi yung sinasabi, create a title na magandang title ng isang pelikula para mas may attraction agad yun, yung, uh, yung title mo. And ang good titles, mga questions eh. Yung, hanggang kailan kita mamahalin? Uh, bulag ba ako? Yan. Or uh, hanggang, uh, hanggang kailan? Ikaw, ikaw na ba? Yan. Mga, mga, mga questions, magandang ng title yan. So that's step two. Concept step one, step two, I convert the concept to the title. Step three, convert the title into a story. Wow! Buuin mo na, buuin mo na yun. Now, of course, a story, yeah, may beginning, and may middle, yan, at may ending. Nice. Part of the script is determine how much story lang ang sasabihin mo. Kasi three and a half minutes to four minutes lang ang kanta. Huwag mo na ikwento yung buong buhay mo. Kung isang linggo lang ang kailangan, no? isang moment lang. Ka. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Three and a half to four minutes, right? Uh-oh. Tapos, uh, of course, while writing the story, there are some technical na mga skills to, like, you determine kung ano yung structure ng kata mo, kung verse chorus, verse chorus. Tapos yung story mo, biyakin mo na yun, pagkasyahin mo na dun sa structure ng kata mo. Para alam mo kung ano nangyayari, kung ano mangyayari, alam mo kung saan matatapos. Hindi yung over story ka o ang dami mong story na nagsasabihin. So that's step three. Uh, convert the title into a story. Step four would be create the melody, compose the melody. Step five, compose the lyrics. Step four and five, pwede interchangeable yun eh. Madali gumawa ng melody pag alam mo ko ng story. Alam mo gumawa ko ng story, melody malungkot, kung masaya yung story mo. Or, di ba? Or otherwise, kung novelty yung story mo, abad, eh, medyo masaya yung melody. Ang lyrics, ang magagaling yan. Ang lyrics, nagagaling yan yung sa story yan. Doon sa binuo mo. Kung step three. So that's step one, two, three, four, five. Concept, title, story, melody, lyrics. Ang six, ang pinakamahalaga. Rewrite. So, after matapos mo yung one to five, ipuswitch ka ng ano mo, ng mode mo. You become your own critic. Ikaw ngayon yung magiging uh, critic ng sarili mong kanta. Babalikan mo ngayon. Uh, I, meron ako sinormulate actually na checklist eh, to be able to assist no? yung mga songwriters to, ano ba, to critic their own song. It's a song evaluation checklist. So you go through the steps one to five. Tapos pag meron differential doon, edi, sure mo lang. Tapos, rewrite. Tingnan mo ulit. Tapos rewrite, rewrite, rewrite. Hanggang kung minis na yung kanta. That's how the process goes. So, may days ako, alam mo, may days ako, Gracie. Step one lang ako. Panay concept lang. Ah, ganun. Hindi sana nakahiga lang ako sa yun sa sofa. Panay concept lang, concept lang. Tapos may base naman, ah, uh, yung lahat ng concept na yun, i-convert sa title. Sa so, marami ako nakaabang na kanta. Dalawang po, tatlong po, panay dami. Ah, uh, ano siya mga songs in the making. Basta I go through the steps, impossible, wala ako matapos. Impossible 'yun. Hindi ko pa na-experience na wala ako natapos. Kasi I go through yung 
a good right. mentor will usher you to a new level of creativity with a proper method at mafo-focus mo ang iyong talento at energies in the right direction. Uh, be able to call yourself a professional. You only need to have the proper skills, but you need to behave then like a professional. Para naman, uh, irrespeto ng uh, common na tao yung ating ginagawa. Treat it like uh, importante siya tulad ng abogado, uh, doktor, ininyero, songwriter. Ano? Ganun na... Sa, tao. sa totoo lang, ang laking bagay nun sa paglika ng kahit na anong bagay, music included, if you have the right mindset, the right attitude, the learning, learning ang ano mo, ang iyong mental state, you're in a learning mode. Dahil madaming talagang sila mapupulot sa mga seniors in the industry, sa mga batikang manunulat ng kanta. You know, the, the, the seniority factor uh, is something that has to be respected. And uh, for the young people of today, how lucky you are, really, that there are people or there is a Mondel Rosario that you can count on to be your mentor. Only an, uh, one, one segment. There are exercises, there are uh, mga, mga forms, evaluation sheets. Tapos, um, meron din, ito yung sinasabi ko na, na consultation. Yan, tanta konsulta. So, one-on-one. -on -one. Um, para as they go along through the songwriting process, no, meron silang way to uh, consult. With the doctor, parang ano ka, nagpunta ka lang sa doktor. Tinatignan mo kung gano'ng ka ka-healthy. Ito naman, punta ka sa akin, tingnan natin kung gano'ng ka-healthy yung kanta ko. Kasi lagi ko sinasabi, ang kantang may sakit, hindi kumikita. Kaya kailangan, kaya kailangan, malaki yung sinasabi, palakasin ang kanta, palakihin ang kita. Tingnan po kasi, sa habang I'm able and healthy and enough, uh, I want to teach uh, mga young songwriters. No? Everything I have acquired from my own mentors. No, that's the only, you know, a uh, composer can only have one lifetime. The only way I can expand my lifetime is by uh, passing on what I know sa mga songwriters. So, pag advantage, hindi mahal yun. No? Hindi mahal ang aking sinisingin. Just enough para ma maging responsible ka doon sa ituturo ko sa iyo. Uh, so, andyan ang uh, so, Subladong Aklat, the Dr. Musico. It's not an e-book only. It's a full songwriting course. Yan ang kansa konsulta. And lastly, uh, itong iaking iwanan. Uh, palakasin ang kanta. Palakihin ang kita. Kita. Naku! Mon, such a... I had such a great time talking to you, hooking up with you after all these years. Uh, ang ating pagmamahal sa OPM, sa nilikhang mga tugtugin ng Pilipino. Talagang malalim ang ating shared love for Filipino music. And I yes. know that um, with your advocacy and your continuing passion uh, to help the industry to manage itself, to nurture new talent, and to have the right discipline for our new members in the musical industry will go a long way. Your legacy will go a long way in improving our young composers, arrangers, and musicians in terms of managing their musical career. So, Stay tuned for the next episode. Only here on V81 Radio, Manila.